4 marks questions from the chapter coordination in life processes let us go into the questions the first question look at the diagram and answer the following questions this is an image representing the teeth in our mouth let us see the questions what does this diagram indicate this diagram indicates the types and arrangement of teeth in our mouth that is dental formula it not only represents the types of teeth but also the number of different types of teeth next question what do a b c and d indicate in this diagram a indicates incisors b indicates canines c indicates premolars and finally the d indicates molars these are the different types of teeth in our mouth in one jaw in one side of the both jaws next question what is the function of a and b type of teeth here a represents the incisors incisors help in cutting the food whereas b represents canines they help in tearing the food next question what is the function of c and d type of teeth in this diagram the c type of teeth indicates premolars which help in chewing the food whereas d indicates molars which help in grinding the food next question uh, what is the formula for this diagram the dental formula of this jaw is 2 by 2 1 by 1 2 by 2 3 by 3 that is there are two incisors one canine and two premolars and finally three molars on both sides of the jaw next question why do we need to have different types of teeth why do we need these kinds of different types can we have only one type of uh, teeth like either premolars or promolars or canines as incisors but we need to have different types of teeth because we eat different types of food hard food soft food etc and there are some fiber food different types of foods so we eat different types of food items and these food need to be chewed properly it has to be cut it has to be teared it has to be grinded it has to be chewed properly for their proper digestion as per the requirement uh I mean uh, of our digestive system so we need to have different types of teeth next question suggest the food habitual actions to your friend while eating and what are the good food habits that we have uh, regarding eating of food or food next answer is take healthy and nutrient food avoid talking while eating take the food leisurely instead of eating in hurry and eat small quantity of food at regular intervals drink sufficient water while eating while eating masticate the food in the mouth for proper digestion take care to maintain fiber food in regular diet finally avoid taking too much antibiotics next question observe the diagram and answer the following questions this is again a diagram based question the first question is what does this diagram indicate this diagram indicates the location of papillae and taste buds on the tongue next one what are the different senses identified with these organs these taste buds identify basically four types of taste such as sweet salt sour and bitter what is the role of palate in functioning of this organ when the food is put on the tongue and pressed with the palate it can easily enter into the papillae of tongue then the taste buds can easily and soon identify the taste what happens if these buds are absent in our tongue if taste buds are absent in the tongue we cannot taste the food hence we may not feel like to eat food this may lead to the malnutrition 